Hey everybody and welcome to the Your Life Blueprint Sound Vibrations. I'm Swami G. That's me. And we're here for Communicator Wednesday. We're here exploring the vibes of the day. Today, Communication Day. Communication. It involves putting on some green. Oh, I failed at that, that one. Burn some cedar incense. I got that one. Play some fourths. I got that. Be serious yet playful today. Hmm. Be witty. Listen to some Keith Jarrett today. A spiritual communicator. Read the Ashtavakra Gita today. That's what I'm going to do right now. It's a treatise on communicator yoga or jnana yoga. The spiritual path of the intellect. Using the intellect to go beyond the intellect. He who has known for certain that adversity and prosperity come in their own time through the effects of past actions is ever contented. He has all his senses under control and neither desires nor grieves. He who knows for certain that happiness and misery, birth and death, are due to the effects of past actions, does not find anything to accomplish, and thus becomes free from care, and is not attached even though engaged in action, is not attached even though engaged in action. He who has realized that it is care and nothing else that breeds misery in this world becomes free from it and is happy, peaceful, and everywhere rid of desires. I am not the body, nor is the body mind. I am consciousness itself. He who has realized this for a certain does not remember what he has done or not done, as if he has attained the state of absoluteness. I am indeed in everything. From Brahma down to a clump of grass, he who knows this for certain becomes free from conflict of thought, pure and peaceful, and free from care, from 
one is attained and not attained, free from care for what is attained and not attained, free from care for what is attained and not attained.